Now forget ELOs and oranges and blues. This is the special one. If you're gonna buy a Lamborghini Urus, then it needs to be something just like this. I call it the Joe Cans Joker Edition. Because of the Viola Mythros purple blue with the amazing green interior, it really is that good. This is a brand new model, Lamborghini Urus on a 23 registration with 7,000 miles on. It's fabulous, 4 litre V8, 666 brake horsepower and not a 60 in 3.5 seconds. Check this out. Yes, we all know with the Lamborghini and Ferraris and stuff, you gotta put loads of extras on because that's what it's all about. This car's got 62 and a half thousand pounds worth of just extras. And that's everything that I'm gonna show you right now from the exterior finishing all the way down to the interior. Power's there, the sound's there, performance is there. It's a brilliant SUV. One would say it's the best performance SUV on the market today. And this has been a brand new model, what you call the 23 model year. It's got a new styling with the new bumper inserts, the rear as well, and then the bonnet venting going on as well. It is really an exciting car from every single angle. So from the front, you've got the Lamborghini Technica LED headlights with the Y lighting, which is here, and that's LED daytime running lights. You've then got the exclusive exterior style package, which costs nearly £3,000. That's all this here, finished in that shiny black. Also the bottom skirt and the diffuser, and then round the back. This car, which costs thousands, by the way, also has a full body PPF. Now, if I was to own this car, a very special paint, one that flickers so well, I'd want to also protect it. So every single part, as in the full front end, arches, bonnet, all the way across, full body PPF. So it's an expensive paint, £15,750 for this metallic paint. I don't do this very often, but if you stay where you are, I am going to move this car forward because the pearl, this is not just a metallic paint, it's a, the pearl that's in it. It's not just purple when you're driving in different light. You can see the blue and different fleck in it. So I'm just going to move it forward and hopefully in the movement of the light, you'll see the different shades of purple and blue in it. I hope you're catching this because it's, it's, it is that nice, really is. I love everything about this because in a minute when I open the door and allow your eyes to feast on the interior, you'll see what I mean. It is mind blowing. Okay, so that was just the exterior. I love it. I'll come back to the exterior in a few more seconds. This is going to be a slightly longer video. You'll appreciate it. Let's have a look at this. Isn't that just the best? With this purple, I mean, if you're Harley Quinn, you're wanting this. Absolutely. Love it. There's thousands and thousands of pounds worth of extras inside here, which I will go through as much as possible, okay, in a few seconds. But I just want you to have a little sneak peek of that quickly. Going back to this, this is not standard, this is an extra, this shiny bonnet vent, costs money. The metallic we know about already. 23 inch upgraded wheels cost nearly three, four thousand pounds. Nearly a thousand pounds for the green brake calipers. But again, that's what you want, the carbon ceramic brakes. There's extended, um, extended exclusive style pack on the arches there. That bottom skirting is all finished in gloss black as well, what they call shiny black. Black window surround, tilt and sliding panoramic roof, nearly four and a half thousand pounds. Soft closed doors, comfort access, you have all that. Now, before you get in, if you like your music, you're gonna love this. Bang and Olufsen sound system, very expensive, but it's a must have on a car like this. You've then got electric seats, heated ventilated seats, a massaging seats, and the button's just there for that one. You've also got the memory set seats in the bottom of the door card, and this ad personum individual leather interior with the green and black, the contrasting stitching costs money, thousands as a matter of fact. But then you have the shiny, because they do a matte finish, this is the shiny carbon interior package, which is on the door cards, all the pieces on the centre dash, and also around the air venting here, as you can see. I think it's nearly a thousand pounds for the Lamborghini badge on the headrest, see it? UV stitching to the backrest. These are nice, sporty, comfortable seats. I'm gonna quickly get in. This has the dark badge package, the dark package, inside package. So the badge in here would normally be in chrome, not everyone knows that. So on the exterior, like the back, I'll show you as I go around it, and the badge in here, that's all finished in black. Again, another extra. This has all been anodized correctly, finished in the matte black as well, because they normally come with a silver finish. So there is no silver on this car, if you notice, and that looks brilliant, other than the little bit around the cup holders, it's perfect. You've got a track air system with this car, which is here two keys, twin cup holders, the different anima drive options, so you've got Strider, Sport, Corsair, Sabia, Terra and Nave, 
so you can pick and choose. The normal stop start button here where you lift it with a, the red flick. The heated, the ventilated seats, the dual zone climate control. If you look at the detailing of the carbon fiber, this is expensive stuff and that's why. It's 62 and a half thousand pounds, it's been crammed into somewhere, it's all this. That's all carbon fiber. Two screen media system, the flat bomb steering wheel with another extra, which is the stitching, you gotta pay for that. Yeah, adaptive cruise control, full virtual cockpit. The banger also gives you the extra speakers on the air pillars and they move in and out so they go all the way in when you turn the engine off and when you start back up again they move up and uh, look really smart. Your full Alcantara roof lining as well and remember this is the tilt and sliding panoramic roof. This is a five seater vehicle SUV that gives all that power that looks as good as this. I'm not joking when I say one of the best looking Lamborghinis, genuine ones out the factory without having it to be modified by somebody else in a third party garage. This has to be hands down one of the top three I've ever seen. USC's third zone climate control, that same seats continue on the back, the black and green, the Lamborghini entry kick plate, fully fitted mat with the piping and leather stitching as well in there. You've then got this exclusive rear spoiler as well, which is an extra. Sport tailpipes, another extra finished in black chrome and they're expensive to have, but you want it because like I said, the car's fully de chrome, so you don't want any part of this car to be silver or, or gray or chrome because it's all this beautiful roller mid-thrust and then you've got the black. Your 360 camera system, automatic tailgate, very nice, generous boot, obviously. The car is light new, so you have all the original stickers in there, under manufacturer's warranty. We've still got the boot liner in there to keep it nice and clean, and underneath, you've also got your sort of foam kit, lock and wheel, etc. This is lovely Alcantara wrapped, and you've got the green stitching. Seats do go down 40, 40, 20. Before I close the boot, this car also has, if you come this way, I don't know why, when you're going to use this, but it's got it, so make use of it. It's got an electric deployable tow bar, which is nice. Just trying to picture this car with a nice horse box in the back. It'll work. It's fab fabulous. So the new model, the 23 model, the facelift model, what we call it, these are the bits that are different. So the previous model, the 21, didn't have this. So they have changed a little bit on the front, on the back, the skeleton, the aerodynamic version of it. Um, looks really good. The Lamborghini entry lighting system just down below. There's a the carbon fiber that continues again. Nice little touch, nice little touch there. Paddle shift, I mean, it sounds. So at the minute I'm in Strada. I'm gonna put it. Corsa, what a. Have you heard that? That's a good sound. Very nice sound. It's got everything heads up display, seating position, it's comfortable. Let me just turn that down a little bit. That's better, isn't it? Just, it's like, it's a Lamborghini that's practical and that's the best thing about it. But with this particular one, it's just gone to another level with the exterior color, the interior color, the amount of specification on this car is mind blowing. I love every single part of this car. If you're outrageous in that way and you like to stand out a little bit, because this is not gonna blend in, it will get people's attention. And you know what, if you've earned it, then you spend it and you make more use of it really because this is absolutely brilliant. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye now.